people. So today, um, I'm going to do some lip swatches for what we call Miss Lena Cosmetics, which is Lena Lashes, and they come in this box. Um, when we're talking about them, I have about, I have nine colors of her liquid lipsticks, and um, I'm going to give you all my pros and cons, and then we'll go from there. So the next thing you're going to see is just my swatch. All right, so let's talk about the different colors. Let me tell you how they come first. All right, let's start there because it'll make sense in just a minute. When I'm serious, it'll make sense. All right, so today I got three, and um, one came in this box, which I already showed you guys, and it says Lena Cosmetics, and then it also says more matte than matte, okay? So this is cool, and here you go. And then on this one is white, and it says the same thing, and then, you know, it says Lena Cosmetics on the back. But when I get the emails, it says Lena, Lena Lashes. So I think they have lashes as well. I, w I don't know. Anyway, so, all right. So I bought them, and there are a couple of things that I don't like about them. Um, no, let's start with the good. All right. I haven't tried every formula. You know, a lot of times with lip, lip, lip blah, 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 liquid lipsticks, they can be different depending on the color. A lot of times because it takes more to do a red color, so to speak, than it would take to do, say, maybe this color. All right, so I would say those are a couple of things. And then that's, you know, the packaging I have a problem with too. And I don't know why because it's not is nothing wrong with this packaging. But it's it's I I will say I know this is an indie brand and she's fairly new and she's you know trying to make her thing and I love the lip the I I I will say this. These lippies how they come or not I just don't like it. I don't know why. I don't like this. It's not appealing to me. Yes, it's gold, but it's not appealing to me. Like, I really, really don't like it. Like, I'm trying to figure out why I don't. There's nothing wrong with it. It's a nice package. I mean, it's, I don't know. I just, I feel like you can go buy this packaging in a beauty supply store and you can get that. And I feel like, I don't feel like she's a drugstore product or and or I don't feel like she should be in a beauty supply store. So for me, when I look at this, I feel like it looks, and I hate to say the word cheap, it just doesn't look the way I feel these are. I feel like they should be in better packaging, Lena. Lena, if you ever see this, I just want to say that I love the product, but the packaging, not so much. All right, so when I got the box, um, I have like I, the yellow. I got these three today. I got, excuse me. I got these three today. Okay. What I don't like is the inconsistency. Maybe this is the new one. I don't like the inconsistency. All right. So when I got it, half of my boxes were like this. They had the product in it. And I'll put the product in. And I'll show you what it looked like. This is how it came. Like that. You know, like sideways, looking the tops and stuff were off. So that's how it came. So I kind of thought that was sort of unprofessional. And then on some of the boxes, as you can see, nothing, nothing. But on other boxes, you have the name on both sides. And then there's another problem with that, too. Um, there, but those are some of the things I want you to be prepared for when you see them because I'm gonna say some things about the product and you might want to try it. And then I didn't tell you about the boxes, how they come, and you know what they look like. And I really needed to explain that, but I'm gonna get into some other things. Um, I like their colors on the website. I mean, I love them. I had a couple, I wore some already, and I know what they feel like. So, like this one. Um, these are two variations of brown, so to speak, but one is slightly, so I have two variations of brown. This is more cool tone and this is more warm, but this is the one that I like. Like I wore this and I liked it. Um, it didn't dry out my lips, but then of course I do put my, you know, my old trusty on my lips every time. Bam! So I always put that on my lips anyway and, you know, try to keep them 
kind of nice before I put on any of those things. I'll put my liner on, kind of pat it down a little bit, just a little bit, and then put my liquid lipsticks on. No, I don't do that every time, but I do try. All right, so we're going to get started because I think I've talked to you enough about these things. Oh, I have one more problem that I didn't like. You know, this. I, this is my first time ever seeing this out the box. I don't like that. I mean, it looks weird and it shouldn't look like that. And then, and it's like that in a few of them. This one is not as bad. And then this one has a few. Um, and I know it's probably from how they put it in, in the bottle, but um, you're gonna have to talk to your people, your manufacturing people, Lena, and tell them that this cannot happen because you have a good product and a nice product and that stuff like that should not happen because your consumers, they tell people and right, like I am telling you, right, telling all of you, I really, I like the lip, liquid lipsticks. I don't like all the colors I got because apparently I don't know how to pick colors. So we're going to start with the first one. And this is Adam. Ooh, y'all. This right here. I had this on today. This one right here. Oh, I do want to tell you, this really, ha really has no smell. You know that smell, like a crayon smell, but really light. I mean, it's like light, but that's what it, and then I don't smell anything, so I don't know. Don't mind me. This one right here is Claude. So this is Claude, and this one looks more like what I was trying to look for. I, I'm sorry, I didn't put a swatch on for the first one, so let's put a swatch on. All right. So this one, the first one is, I don't know, Kevin or something like that. Don't care. That's the first one since, see it? All right, and this is the second one, which is Claude. And I think that's the, the effect I was trying to go for, but this reminds me of the Kat Von D Lolita. I don't know why, but it does. Um, Lolita 2, maybe? Lolita 2. All right, so we're gonna put this one on. <laughs> I don't know why I do that with my eyes. What can I say about this one? It's not bad. It's just not for me. And for real, like with my face right now, I mean, it's for real not for me. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is not for me, people. This is like, in here it looked purple, purple. And on my face, it looks like baby pink. In the mirror, it looks baby pink. But in here, it doesn't look baby pink. It looks purplish. <laughs> purplish. But I'm not digging this one either. Damn. But let me, let's, okay. Just because I don't like the color does not mean I don't like the formula. Does that make sense? Um, they go on real smooth. It has a moussey texture. They go on very smooth. Um, 
can be patchy the lighter it's always like that with light colors they can be patchy um, dark colors too but light colors ugh, depending on what your lips are like all that stuff but um like right now this is so soft you guys when i say soft this is soft um let me just think this is soft <laughs> this is soft i mean like they feel good they know when they start drying and it takes a few minutes for it to dry but that doesn't bother me a lot. Um, with a lot of people be like, oh my God, it takes too long. It should dry real fast. Those are too dry. Um, so these feel good. Like they don't suck your lips in. They feel really good. So at the end of the day, I might not like this color. I didn't like the first the first three colors. I don't like them. So I'll probably I'll never wear them. I'll probably give them some money. My family, I can't say anything about the formula. I can only talk about the color doesn't look right on me because the formula... I like the former. It's comfortable, you guys. It's comfortable. Um, like I said, if you have dry lips, anything you put on your lips that's going to mattify is not going to do well unless you put some sort of moisture to your lips prior or, you know, scrub them, then put some kind of layer of lip balm or whatever makes you happy. Um, then you should put it on with it because if your lips are dry this is just going to dry it out more so based on what i've done with my lips i can't tell you how it would feel without it no yes i can because i put it on on my way home and it felt good like it didn't feel weird it wasn't dry it did not dry on my mouth where i couldn't talk and i felt like i was gonna crackle it didn't do that the only problem that i must say that i had was how it wore off and how it wore off it was like right here it started wearing down so if i kept this on a little while this will wear down but anyway on to the next okay so i like this all right so <laughs> let me just <clears throat> anyway so i like this one um i think that i can pull this one off so you're gonna go in the keep pile so this is Guy, and this is what it looks like. Okay. Okay, I like this one. This one is nice. I love this one. Look at it, y'all. It goes with me. It even goes with what I got on my face right now. Go. So, this is no name. This one is Jason. You can see the little cracky things in there. But this one is Jason. And this is more like a berry color. But I guarantee you it's going to look different on my hand than what it looks like in here. So, let's check her out. Oh, wow. Here she is. That's gorgeous, y'all. Ooh, this is like a reddish burgundy. It got purple. It has a purple undertone. I like this lip. I like this because it lets you do the line around your lip. I'm 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 all about that. I like the other ones, but this gives you the line around the lip. So it lets you line your lip while you're putting it on. So I'm happy about that. All right, so I like this color too. <laughs> I like this color. I like Jason. I love Jason right now. I'm loving on Jason right now. I'm loving on Jason right now. I'm loving on Jason. I'm loving on Jason. I'm loving on Jason. <laughs> okay, I'm being silly, but I really like this, and it goes with my eye look today. My little, you know what I got going on. But I, it this one dry. This one dry, like, my mouth is dry, y'all, except for this part right here. Seriously? The only part that you see on my hand, not the first, not this one, but that is the middle. And that's because it's not dry yet. But this sucker is matte fast. This one. But this one is matte fast, really fast. 
but it doesn't feel as comfortable as the other ones, which is odd to me because they're from the same company, but this one feels really, really dry. Like, yeah, it's like really dry, y'all. But it's probably because also too that I have taken these off, off and on and so I could have probably dried out my lips. Okay, let's discuss this. <laughs> I am trying to get this off with my thing and I am really rubbing y'all. Are you freaking kidding me? I only had it on like a minute. Oh my God, y'all. I cannot get this off my mouth. Are you freaking... All right, so this is Dante. This is the one I think I saw. No, I gotta, you know I'm sweating. This is the one I thought, this is the one I think I saw first. And this is the one I really, really wanted. And so here we go. All right, so this one is, what did I say? Dante, Dante. I like Dante. Dante. Dante, I love you. Anyway, so this is Dante. And this one's a little tackier. And it dries really fast too. It's not on my lips right, y'all. So, you know, I'm at the point of, I'm down to two more left. So now I don't really care how my lips, my lips are gonna hurt no matter what. Cause they're liquid lipsticks. What told me to just go ahead and put all, all these daggone liquid lipsticks? I don't know. I skipped a spot right there. I skipped a spot up there. <laughs> Look how fast that got dry. Look at my lips, y'all. They crazy dry. I don't know. The lighter colors were the moosier ones. And the more dark I get, the faster they... The darker ones are dry really fast, but I don't know if I like them. It feels like crust on my lips, like, yeah. It's weird. I know you ain't supposed to do all that with liquid lipsticks, but it just feels weird on my mouth. And like the other ones, those light ones, they were so freaking soft and fantastic. And like I said, it could be because my lips are dry now, but I just put some stuff on my lips, so it shouldn't be. But I don't know if drying fast is a problem for me or that it feels like it's drying on my lips. Is that the problem for me? Um, it's still not very, it's not uncomfortable. It's not uncomfortable, not at all. But at the same time, it's just like real. It's so dry, like it's no margin for error. Like this dries so fast. So I don't know if I can tack it on. Did I put it on, did I put Dante on my arm? Nah. Okay, that's Dante right there so I'm let's see if it'll layer All right, so I layered it. It actually feels better, y'all. It actually feels better. It feels moosey like those. So that wasn't bad. It doesn't feel weird. Like to put the, to put the second layer on wasn't bad at all. Like not bad. It doesn't even feel like when I was just doing it, when I put on only one coat, 
it was like weird like it was dry and I, I feel like I've been rubbing my lips too much too but it felt weird this after I put the second coat on I would have to see what it wore like in the rest of the day but this hot this is nice I'm excited this is cool and it's dry and I know you can put something on top if you choose so like a lip gloss and because you don't want your lips to look all dried out but I'm digging it so no complaints from me no complaints from me <laughs> let's see how hard it is come off y'all see that it's still there y'all it's still there I don't know what else to say I got a little bit on the second round a little bit but if this is what it's going to act like when I'm eating or whatever, it's going to take me a minute to come off. Let me see if I put some, um, some. <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? It made it sticky. That's what it did. I put all that on my lips and it did not move. Not. And it didn't help any either. This is Brad. Hi, Brad. I have a lot of editing to do. That's Brad. That is Brad. And he feels good on my lips. So, remember how I said the um, the lighter ones were very moussey and they, take, they felt good on the lips. And then I put the reds on and they flipped out. This is back to being moussey. So, Brad. I have, I have popcorn, y'all. Sorry. Brad feels really good on the lips. It just does. It's like really nice. And uh, and it doesn't, and it's not drying fast. Like those other two, they dried so fast. But this one is taking a little bit longer, but this one feels nice on the lips. So on to the next. This is no name. This right here is no name. <laughs> it's another variation of brown. This is like the dark chocolate brown. This is the dark chocolate brown and this is milk chocolate. So this is like fudge brown, but it's pretty. My husband hates browns on me, y'all. He hates them. He's like, it's most, most look like your skin color. <laughs> Which is odd because the lighter, the milk chocolate brown, is, if you look at the difference, the milk chocolate brown is still going, you know, what is on? It's still drying down. That one is already dry. See what I'm saying? It's already dry. So this is another one of those that go on the lips and like only spot that's not dry is right there, right there. But the rest of my lip is dry as heck. I was just trying to see if it crum it crumbles, but it's it's crazy dry, y'all. Like crazy dry. You're gonna really have to put something under here because it's crazy dry. 
But that's my last one. So this is no name. I don't know what your name is. I don't know what your name is, but I like you. But I like them all in all. All right. <clears throat> so I kind of talked to you a lot about how I felt about these um, Lena lashes. Um, besides the color that I chose, I spent my own coin. So if I chose the wrong colors, I just chose the wrong colors. But I'm going to say the light ones are really moussey and they feel really good on the lips. The red ones, um, make sure you put on some lip liner, some something, something like this on your lips. Not this because this is too dry, but some kind of lip balm on your lips because the red ones are going to dry out so fast and then you're going to, it's like your lips but they're this still is still not uncomfortable even though it dries so fast and the brown ones is it's between the two this one still is drying down see that this one which is this one is dry as hell <laughs> already see what i'm saying so at the end of the day i would say brad far as the silkiness and the texture. Brad is good. Um, this no name one is good too, but you have to know if you buy these that some of them are going to dry down more than the others. So don't be upset if you buy them and then you're like, hi, you you said you like these. I do like them. I like them a lot. And um, even the ones that dry down really fast, I like them. Um, would I wear, is it something that I will wear every day? Probably not because I have 50 million lipsticks. Is it something that someone else could pull off every day? I think if you have the right skin tone, you could pull off the light ones because the light ones are nice. Um, they feel so stinking good, but I can't wear that. So I'll probably give it to my niece and stuff so they can play with it. Um, the red ones, I love. Like the red tone ones, I really like a lot. They just dry down real fast and you just have to be prepared for that. And then the brown ones, of course, I like them because they're brown. They're brown. I love anything brown. Um, so with that... What I have on my lips right now, in case you're wondering, is a dose of colors. Which one is this? Mood. No, this don't say mood, do it? Yep. So this is the dose of colors mood that I have on my lips right now. Okay. So if I should say um, how these dry down, see they dry down really good. Um, for it says matte more than matte. So if you're looking for a true matte. These are true mattes. These will be your true mattes. Um, I know there's a lot of matte lipsticks out there that don't be matte. They, I don't know what the heck they are, but these are true mattes. So I just want to tell you guys I love you and I appreciate you coming back to my channel. I appreciate you listening to my ideas and, and all those different things. You are much appreciated. Um, and if you're new, you know what to do. It's right down there. Like right down yes. down there to the side up there maybe over here wherever it is you know what to do you might as well go ahead and subscribe just subscribe just just do it i'm waiting okay so you did it <laughs> so i appreciate you being here honestly and thanks for watching please don't forget to give me a thumbs up share and like and subscribe you know what to do Anyway, love you guys. Bye now.